In this video, we're going to show you how you can install Axiom 1.21.7, which is by far the best way to customize your Minecraft worlds. It's essentially like world edit, and here's exactly how you can get it installed. Real quick before we dive into it, make sure to like the video and subscribe, it really does help out the channel. But first things first, if you are in Minecraft, go ahead and close out of this, and yes, this does include the launcher. Open up a web browser of your choice, in this case, we're going to go ahead and use Google Chrome, and go up to the very top and search for axiom mod minecraft go ahead and hit enter and find this first page up at the very top that says mod Renth. open this up and it should look something like this find the versions tab and then go ahead and choose the game version for 1.21.7 by filtering it just like so go ahead and find this little download icon and click on it and it should start automatically downloading for you right up here now you may notice that this is a fabric mod, which does mean that we are going to need fabric and fabric API installed. If you already have this installed, just drop that folder into your mods folder and you're done. That being said, if you don't have it installed, don't worry. We're going to go ahead and go over that right now. Open up another tab and search up fabric API and hit enter. You may notice that the first page is cursed forge. Go ahead and open that one up. Go to the file section and then select the game version for 1.21.7. At the very top, go ahead and choose this option and click the three dots and find download file. And it's going to take you to a page that looks like this. Just wait five seconds and it's going to automatically start downloading for you up at the top. If it does say something like suspicious download blocked, don't worry about that. Click on this little arrow and then hit download suspicious file. Now open up another tab and just search up fabricmc.net and hit enter and it's going to take you to a page that looks like this hit download and then hit download for windows and once again it's going to automatically start installing and what you're going to want to do first is actually double click on this fabric installer just like so it's going to open up a page that looks like this make sure you select version 1.21.7 and make sure that you do have this create profile option checked off there from here just hit install and then you can close out of it now that it's installed, go ahead and close out of Chrome or whatever web browser you chose and open up the Minecraft launcher. You may notice that you'll now have a fabric loader right here. If you don't have this in this arrow, just double click on this arrow thing and open up this section and find that fabric loader. And then go to the installations tab up at the top and find that same loader and click on this little installations folder. From here, look for the mods folder just like so and open it up. If you don't have a mods folder, just go ahead and search for it or hit or right click and then hit new and then select folder. Just make sure it's named exactly like this. Now from here, go ahead and drag that off to the side and open up another file explorer and open up the downloads folder. From here, drag in fabric API and drag in Axiom as well. Now you can close out of all of these tabs except the Minecraft launcher, hit play, confirm that it is on that fabric loader and hit play again. Now, once Minecraft does load for you, go ahead and open up a single player world to actually just text Axiom. I'm going to just choose, uh, I guess, this one right here. And once you get loaded into the world, all you need to go ahead and do is, first of all, confirm that's installed. It should pop up with something like this, if that's the case for you. It'll walk you through an entire tutorial just like so. So I recommend actually paying attention to that rather than skipping through it. But really, all you need to go ahead and do is actually just press shift right below enter, which is going to be that right shift, by the way. And it's going to bring up the Axiom interface. You can now place points, build structures, and start customizing however you want. Axiom is like world edit, but more powerful and beginner friendly. I'm going to be honest, I'm not an expert with it at all, but there's a ton that you can do. Plus, if you do want to use it in multiplayer, you will need your own server. If you want me to make a tutorial on how to do that, let us know down in the comments below and I'd be happy to help you out. That being said, if this did help you out, make sure to leave a like on this video, share it with some friends, and of course subscribe to the channel with all notifications on. And I hope to see each and every one of you guys in the next video. Peace!